Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of March, okay? Keep in mind this is being recorded in February. It could resonate in February, but I urge you to watch it in March because this is a preview of what's to come for March. So what do we have for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? for the month of March. What do we have? One more card, please, for Aquarius for March. Well, I guess we're gonna take a couple. So, let's see, what do we have for Aquarius? Horseshoe, good luck. So some sort of luck is on your side. Basket, recognition, reward for merit. Flowers, happiness. Spear, heartache over what you no longer have. So you may be hurting over something that you no longer have, but I do feel like happiness is coming you're going to be getting some sort of recognition and luck is on your side so what more can i say other than happiness is coming right um you're getting a reward i mean good luck if you think about good luck it's kind of like the wheel of fortune so something very fortunate is coming towards you if it hasn't arrived already so you know it looks it looks really good even though there's some sort of heartache here heartache is a fact of life um, so yeah, I feel like there's some sort, and I think that the heartache is, is going to start to dissipate. If there is some, I think it's going to start to dissipate because I see things blossoming. I see a period of growth and you are receiving some sort of abundance by the looks of things. Things are about to get better. Things, there's going to be a turn, you know, a turn in energy or, or obviously there is with all the Aquarius energy, you know, there's a shift. Things are going to shift for you if they haven't already. What do we have for Aquarius? Truth. This is judgment. So this is truth. This is the end of things, a life-changing decision, um, a final decision, an awakening, an epiphany. Um, absolution. So this is the end of something. It is. If you think about the court, when the judgment is made, the truth has been heard, and it's, it's time for the verdict. So there's something, there's some, this is the end, okay? You've reached the end of a trial, okay? You've, this is definitely the end of a situation. If you've, if you've been in some sort of situation where there's been a lot of judgment, or there's been a lot of uh, information that has been going back and forth it's all coming to an end so you know if you think about going to court you know where there's a lot of things that come out you know and there's a lot of heartache obviously usually when somebody goes to court you know it does cause heartache it causes uh stress you know so it and then not and then this could be universal court it doesn't have to be legal i mean it could definitely be legal but this could be universal judgment of some sort Things have been stressful. It's a stressful situation that is absolutely coming to an end. Put it that way. Okay. Whatever is happening, I think it's going to turn out in your favor. I guess that's it, huh? Children, your love life is being affected by children. So this may have something to do with children. Either way, there's going to be some sort of verdict or some sort of judgment that is made. Somehow children play a part. I think that's going to go in your favor. You know, I feel it because there's some sort of recognition and reward for your merit. There's something, you have earned something. Maybe it's respect. Whatever's happening, you're going to be very happy with the verdict. This is a happy verdict. It's a happy outcome. There's going to be a resolution by the looks of things this month. 
Whatever this resolution is, the heartache is going to end. It's going to end. It is. Luck is on your side. Wheel of Fortune. I said, when I was saying luck is on your side as I pulled this card, because I was looking at this one. So this is destined. It's a destined change of events. It's a destined change of course. Okay, this is definitely good luck. Good karma. This is a card of karma. This is a card of karma. You are, and this is a reward, and we got reward here. You're going to be receiving some sort of reward, and it could be a reward from the universe. Okay? Um, may have something, obviously, to do with children. Um, this is the end of a chapter. It's a completion of, some, major completion. Something is ending that has really affected you. You are, you're, you you're, spinning in a new direction this is a very positive positive uh, fortunate event whatever it is something very fortunate is coming your way nine of cups reverse now the nine of cups reverse is not happy you know, somebody's not happy. This is lack of wish fulfillment, but I feel like it's in the past. You may be in a place where, I don't know if you've been dealing with somebody that's been going overboard. This person was egotistical. You know, they wanted to have it all. This is somebody that, uh, we got a head on a platter here, which is interesting. We got somebody here, but it's reversed. That is definitely not happy with the change of events. You definitely are going to have somebody that is not happy with the changes that you are making or whatever it is that you're receiving. Um, this is lack of wish fulfillment. It's a lack of happiness, a lack of abundance. If you have been in a place where you've been worried whether you were going to get what you wanted or the outcome was going, you're going to go in your favor, I do believe the outcome is going to go in your favor. Um, Wheel of Fortune, that is a positive change moving in a new direction. For some reason, I want to tell you that, you know, uh, the answer is yes. This is a yes answer to something. Um, this is on the path to recovery. You are, somebody may be asking for forgiveness or you may be leaving the past hurts behind. This is healing. This is healing from something. Um, this is a time of recovery, recovering from a broken heart, recovering from a situation where somebody has been hurt very, very badly. So now you're going to be healing from something. There is definitely a healing energy for some of you, not everybody. There could be a reconciliation with children or something like that. Um, there is something to do with children here. A decision is going to be made. There's going to be a destined uh, change. You are recognized for your hard work. You're recognized for your merit. Three of Swords on the path to recovery. Leaving the past hurts behind. Healing. It's going to be a time of healing. You're going to be healing over something. You're, you're changing your path. Your destiny is changing. You may have been hoping and wishing for some sort of reconciliation as well with somebody that hurt you. Because I feel like there's a lot of hurt here, obviously, with, with this one and this one. Somebody's been hurt really, really badly. They've been stabbed in the heart, you know, by somebody that is very egotistical, that um, wanted to have it all but didn't want to put in effort. It may have something to do with children. Children may have gotten involved or it has something to do with children, but this is on the path to recovery. You're about to go in a new direction, and it's a very positive new direction. This is making a judgment call. You may have received a wake-up call or some sort of epiphany that moves you in a new direct direction. I do see you going in a new positive direction. Um, King of Wand could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Maybe this person is the one that broke your heart. Um, but this is finding the confidence and the strength and the courage and the desire and the ambition to leave the past hurts behind. 
I think you are definitely, you are dealing with somebody that is very feisty, very, very passionate. Maybe there's somebody here that is going to help you to heal. You could be dealing with somebody that is very um, knowledgeable, that is very, very skilled, that is coming around, that can, that can, that is very passionate about what they do, that is going to help you in some way. This is somebody that is in a position of authority that can help you. They're going to help. It feels like you're going to be, somebody is going to be uh, taking charge and helping you in some way. They're helping you. This is somebody that is very knowledgeable, that is in a position of leadership and is very um, experienced. So we have an experienced individual here that has already been uh, hurt very, very badly, that has life experience, that I feel like sees something in you. They see something in you that is very, very positive, which is interesting. Re now we got judgment again. We have, this is as rebirth. We have this is 20 and this is 20. So this is definitely a rebirth of some sort. This is a new beginning. What is judgment? Judge if you think about judgment day, you know, when when, when judgment day you picture judgment day when you're releasing you know and you're asking there is forgiveness here there is forgiveness there's forgiveness there's releasing there's uh starting over releasing the past judgment is a card of the past it's accepting the past um it's starting a new life so i do feel like you're going to be starting a new life this is the very, very, very beginning of a new life. I feel like you're just about to go through those gates. There's been some sort of... There, there, you're about to go through some sort of gates that have been closed. The gates have been closed, but the gates are about to open. And I about, and you are you are about to start a new life. And I, what, what, you know, um, you're going down a new path definitely towards happiness. There's no doubt about it. Um, for some of you, there could be a birth, there could be a pregnancy, there could be news of a pregnancy or a new birth, just saying. Um, we def it's definitely a very fertile time, so there's things are going to be um, happening during this time, you know. Um, if somebody has hurt you really bad, there's some sort of justice that is coming. I know this is the judgment card, but this judgment is very similar to justice. Um, you may have been in an unhappy place. You may be, you may have been thinking that you're never going to get wish fulfillment or you're never going to get recognized. And maybe it has something to do with children. I don't know. But there is somebody here that is interested or that is very, very attracted. This person is mature. They have a lot of life experience and I feel like they are about to show up if you're single. If you are in a relationship right now, um... You know, you, there there could be issues with children. If 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 you have been hurt or in some sort of pain, I do see that things are going to come to an end, and and uh, this is it's the end. It's the end of a situation where there's been a lot of stress and heartache and pain. Um, you are definitely moving in a positive direction. This is the birth of a new life. This is if you think about. You think about um, the phoenix rising from the ashes. That's exactly what this is. It's like you you are you're you're going to be stronger because of the experience that you went through. Um, whatever is happening, luck is on your side. If there is a judgment being made by the divine or by um, the the law, it's going to go in your favor. It is going to go in your favor, and I think it, for a lot of you, it does it does have to do with ch a child. Not everybody. It won't that won't be the case for everybody. Um, a decision is definitely being made. Judgment, and you have it twice, is about decision. And the King of Wands is somebody that is making a decision. So there, w there will be a very prominent decision that is made in March. And this decision has to do with leaving something behind that caused you a lot of heartache and pain and suffering. Um, ooh. Eight of Swords. Now, the Eight of Swords is mental turmoil. Somebody is trapped in a situation. They need to escape. They haven't been able to escape. They've been, but there's somebody that is coming to help. And I and and I just want to say that there's there's help arriving. 
There is definitely some help arriving. Somebody has been in a desperate situation where they have been confined, they have been restricted, they they haven't found their courage or their confidence to break free, or they just haven't been able to for some reason because they were hoping and wishing for a reconciliation or hoping and wishing for another chance. Somebody has been stuck in a situation not seeing clearly. They've been choosing not to see it clearly. They've, been, they've made themselves a victim. Somebody has been cho has chosen to be a victim to a circumstance that is not healthy. And I feel like this is awakening. This is a wake-up call. This is definitely a wake-up call. I do believe that somebody is coming to help another person heal and break free from a situation that is not healthy. It is not healthy. And there's going to be a new life that is starting. This is an absolutely beautiful new life. Um, somebody is going to be recognizing your your um, needs. It feels like it's needs. You know, somebody is going to be coming to your aid. That's what I see. Um, a judgment is going to be made or a decision is going to be made and it's absolutely going to go in your favor. Um, this is like starting from scratch as well because of this baby but babies you know this is a definitely starting from scratch so i do believe you are going to be starting from scratch if you are a single woman you're say you're a single woman and you're watching this you are going to get with somebody that is very well endowed okay i'm just saying i'm just saying this person is well endowed um and they are very passionate and they're very they have a they're very uh sexy so this person is is going to uh you know you need to be careful because you could get pregnant there could be a pregnancy that is on the horizon here okay for some of you there could be a pregnancy that is on the horizon um there is also i feel like there's also a past life connection here with somebody there's a past life connection so there could be a reunion with somebody that you met in a past life um, now it's time. It's time. This person is coming to break you free from a karmic situation. Okay? So just saying. Um, that's for some of you. Um, either way, I do believe that you have a... Luck is on your side. You may run into somebody. Um, you're not even looking. You're not even looking. You could have just run right into somebody. Um, could be at a government building, and I don't know why I see that. It could be at some sort of government agency or something like that. Um, there is definitely somebody that is going to be, I feel like there's some sort of communication coming in for you. I think if you've been in a place where you've been stuck, you've been trapped, and you've been unable to break free, whoever this person is that is coming is going to really open your eyes. They're really going to make you see something that you have been reluctant to see. And it has to do about with somebody from your past. You're going to be leaving something in the past, put it that way. You're going to be leaving something in the past. Um, things are going to be changing in a very, very positive manner for you. Um, I mean, what more can I say other than things are going to change in a positive manner? You're headed in the right direction. Everything is, something is going to go in your favor. Some sort of judgment is going to be made, whether it's from the universe. Whatever it is, it's going to go in your favor. So yeah, I'm going to get one more card and then it's over. Birth of a new life right here. There's going to be an arrival as well. You, there's going to, I feel like it's an unexpected arrival, whether it's a pregnancy or it's a person. There's an unexpected arrival here. Queen of Cups. If you're a man watching this, there's a woman here that is very loving, very gentle, very kind. This could be a nurse. It could be a counselor. It, it is somebody that is very, it could be a medium, could be a tarot reader, could be somebody that, this is obviously somebody that is very intuitive, very spiritual, very fluid, a very sensitive, that is uh, looking for love. So there is somebody here that is looking for love. Um, and this could be for a man or a woman here. We definitely have a couple. We have somebody here that is, is really 
um, looking for love and does not realize that there is an opportunity. What you want, wants you, okay? Somebody is definitely, I feel like they're calling in a soulmate. I think this is a past life connection. There is love here. There is absolute love here. So we have two people that are, I feel like they're meant to be. Uh, Wheel of Fortune is a card of destiny, okay? It's meant to be. We have we we have a couple. I feel like we have a couple that is that is coming together, and there and there could it could result in a child. I'm just saying it could definitely result in a child. Um, we have a couple that is coming together that are going to um, be making a did a life changing decision. This is definitely a life changing decision. Um, Yeah, so I mean, what more can I say other than luck is on your side? This is a positive change in direction. There is love, there is passion, there is growth, and there is acceptance. This is the end of a painful situation. There is healing, a connection. This is the birth of a new life. You may have been struggling, somebody may have been struggling, they may not have been seeing clearly. But now there's there's some sort of freedom, okay? There's freedom of some sort. There's liberation. Somebody is coming to help somebody heal. We have a healer here. Whatever is happening, you're going to be really, really happy. Very, 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 very happy. Good luck. <laughs>